Hi everybody, thank you for joining me. This is Robert Harley coming to you again from uh, the comfort of my home. <laughs> this is the X, the Excelia Live Show. Um, tonight we're going to continue talking about what we were talking about last night, which is paradigm and your mindset. Um, to last night, my video, as you know, as I explained to you in, my, in a note from last night, that last night my video just got suddenly got cut off. I wasn't quite finished talking about what I was talking about last night when the video just suddenly stopped because of technical issue. Um, so now we just want to continue. So tonight might not be that, that long of a video because uh, um, actually last night when it, at the time when it cut off, I, I was able halfway finish what I was going to say anyways. Anyways, <laughs> I didn't mean to, I just feel like, felt like explaining myself. From what happened last night um so we're gonna get back into it but before i do that just to do this quickly thing one like the video two share the video and three leave a comment on the video please i would greatly greatly appreciate you doing that for me and um the share the videos on your on your um your, your, your timeline and in your group or groups that you belong to and um I like to see my, you know, the videos getting more, much more higher views. I'm kind of a little disappointed. I don't know what to do to get to get more views. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna have to work on that to get more views. I know one thing is because I do these videos so late at night, so I need to um, do them er much earlier. Maybe that's one way I can increase how much views I get. Anyways. Um, <laughs> So we're going to continue from last night. Last night we were talking about paradigm. And we, the night before, we talked about paradigm. We, de, we define what a paradigm is. And um, so I don't want to do too much recap. I just want to read what, what tonight is. I really just want to pick up from where I left off last night from when my, my video got suddenly cut off. And um, just get continue right from there and then just keep going from there so we talk about paradigm we're talking about paradigm and you and your mindset you and your mindset so we 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 have these things here we were talking about this um in the video last night let me see if we can i'm playing with the light here i have a light because <laughs> i have a glare right here in the, in the screen that they want to get rid of anyways Hope you guys can see this so over here on, on this screen you have re rewards and then over here we have penalty over here we have results versus excuses over here we have can or can't and we said based on your mindset the kind of mindset you have or your paradigm you have you always you'll be on one of these um one of this one of these sides here depends like when it when it comes to pursuing your goals and your dreams and living the kind of life you want and getting different results than you than you have been get, getting in your life you got to look at that look at look at what side of this equation you are on when you discover that you can discover you can it's like a self-discovery. You can you can see why you're getting the kind of results that you get. If when it comes to pursuing your goals and your dreams and want to want to want to change your life for the better, if you if you're looking at the penalty of making changes in your life versus looking at the re rewards, then you know your kind of mindset you have. If you're always looking for excuses rather at the results that you will get then you know what kind of mindset you have if you're always thinking of can't oh i can't do that i can't do this you know i can't you, you you're always thinking can't instead of can see yourself that they can do it then you know what kind of mindset you have and you know where where you start you need to start going to work on yourself because we all have we have all we all have areas in our lives that we need to work on. We need to change and grow and develop. So you we are what what the secret is is to discover where you are, where you are in terms of your mindset and the way you think, where you are in terms of your paradigms, what kind of paradigms are running your life. Because it's your paradigm, your mindset is what runs your life. 
a couple of nights ago, we got into it where we were talking about the, the two different minds. We have the conscious mind and we have the unconscious mind or, or the subconscious mind. And we say that the, the, that your, 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 your subconscious mind is what really is like the hard drive of a computer. That that's where the subconscious mind or the unconscious mind, you know, whether you use the word unconscious or subconscious, you're talking about the same thing. Unconscious mind, subconscious mind is the same thing. So there's two different terminology people use. Some people say unconscious, some people say subconscious, <laughs> but it, you're talking about the same thing. So, but the, un, the subconscious mind is where is your deck, it's like the hard drive of your computer. Now, we all know that the computer is, is the, uh, what's ever stored on the computer, hard drive is what, when the, what's you gonna, you, the, what's gonna determine how the computer is, is run, right? It, what you see on the screen of your computer when you're on the computer, what you see on the screen of your computer, um, it's only results of the what's on the, re, on, on what's on the hard drive of the computer. Right, and that's the same thing with your mind. Your mind, what you're thinking in your mind, it, your mind is like this, this, the scream of the computer. I, I, I've explained all this before a couple of videos ago. I guess I don't mind reviewing it again. Maybe if someone have watching me have watching me for the first time. So your 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 your, your conscious mind, the mind that you use to think, the conscious mind that you're conscious aware of. That mind is like the computer screen, is what you're seeing, what you're viewing. But the subconscious mind is like the hard drive of your computer that's actually runs the computer. And that's the same thing. The same thing is true where your where your life is concerned. Your life is run by the by by the hard drive, by the subconscious mind or the unconscious mind of your brain of your of your brain. And uh, of your brain, of your of your mind, there's two. The, the mind is break up in, break up into two different categories: of the conscious mind and the subconscious mind. So, but we said a couple of nights ago, a couple of videos ago, that the the paradigms that we have, they're all ingrained. They're all ingrained. I can't find a better word to use. Ingrained on the subconscious mind. Now, the conscious mind, the subconscious mind, like a computer hard drive can be reprogrammed okay it can be reprogrammed and so based on what's on what's programmed on this computer is how you how you you will see you will you will see things so if you, if you're always looking at the penalty side of things versus the reward side of things you know what kind of paradigm music you have if you're always looking, at, looking for the excuses rather than the results, you know what kind of paradigm you have. If you're always thinking can't versus can, you you know what kind of paradigm you have. Okay? So you always, always, you always want to know is you knowing the what kind of mindset is like it's like the, the first step in 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 changing your paradigm and changing your mindset and changing your life is you give you got to first know where where am i where am i where am i in terms of my thinking where where am i in terms of my paradigms where am i in terms of of of, of the way i see things the way i see myself the way i see my the world around me remember the paradigms is a mindset and the mindset is your is your is your thinking and believing of all oh, that you're thinking and believing about yourself and about the world around you so whatever you you believe about yourself and how you view yourself and whatever you, you believe around the the the, you, the world around you and how you view it that's your mindset. That's how you think. That influence how you think, and the, the world around you will influence your mindset. Um, someone just jump on here. Let me see who that is. That oh, Benjamin. Then Benjamin. Thank you for Benjamin Lake. Thank you for um for for tuning in. I re really appreciate you coming on. Um, believe it or not, I'm almost finished. <laughs> um, but 
you want to know where your paradigms are, what kind of how you think, how you perceive yourself, how what you believe about yourself and the world around you. I said a couple of videos ago. Again, you know, I encourage you, everyone, to you know, go back and watch the last few videos, the last yesterday's video, the day, the day before, a couple of days. At least go back three videos because the, you know all these videos for the last almost two weeks now that I've that I have been doing, they're all tied in, in in with each other. They all it's like they build on top of each other, so. You may, um, maybe you need to go back to even you know a week ago or two weeks ago of me of me watching of watching my videos to kind of um, they um they kind of build one on top of each other because it's like a continuation. <laughs> I started a couple of weeks ago before the, the new year talking about preparing yourself to make this year the best year ever. We talk. We get into goal setting. We talk about setting goals. We talk about discovering your why, knowing what your why is. Um, we talk about planning for this year, and then now we just the last few videos we kind of get into the mindset. What kind of mindset you need to have? Discovering your paradigms. We talk about paradigms and your your um um and your mindset that you have and discovering what kind of mindset. This is what we're talking about right now. What kind of mindset you have when it comes to pursuing your goals and your dreams, or when it comes to you wanting to change your life so you can get different results than what you've been getting. How do you feel? How do you view things? Do you always look at the reward side of things or on the penalty side? You know, you're always looking for why things won't work. You know, why it will, 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 it will fail. Are you looking for, you're looking, you're looking for results of things, or are you looking for excuses of things? Are you always making up excuses, right? Or, you know, whatever excuse they might come up with. You know, I don't, I don't have time, I don't have money, I don't have, you know, I don't have, I'm not smart enough, I'm not educated enough, and I'm not, you know, whatever excuse I might want to come up with. You know, you're looking for excuses versus the results. You want the results. But sometimes you, people just make excuses. And then are you always looking at the can't? You know, why, why you can't do something? Or are you looking at the, are, are, are you looking at the can, why you can do something? You know, we all should develop a, um, a little attitude I call, I can and I will. I can and I will. I can do this and I will do this. You know, I can and I will. You, know, you, have, you have that kind of attitude, I can and I will. That's something you always have to have, you know, especially when you come to pursuing your goals and dreams and, 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 and working on yourself. You have this attitude, I can and I will. 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 You know, I've said that to myself all the time, you know, even just thinking, I don't always say it out loud, but I think that sometimes, just like I think, you know, those thoughts, I can and I will, especially when doubt and fear and, in, and in uncertainty pops up in my mind and my head, you know, <laughs> I have to kind of push those kind of thoughts away, push them down or push them out of my mind completely by just thinking, I can and I will, I can and I will. I can and I will accomplish my goals and my dreams. I can and I will do this. I can and I will you know, finish my book. I can and I will. You know, you push those negative thoughts out of your mind by confessing that, thinking those things. Sometimes I end up saying it out, out loud, but a lot of times I just think it. I can and I will. I can and I will. I can and I will. And that's the whole you have to do it. You have to, you know, replace those negative thoughts with the positive thoughts of, of affirmation. Anyways, we are. I am going to cut it here tonight because of, because this is kind of basically um, a continuation from last night. Last night, my as I explained to you at the, at the beginning of this video, my video was cut short and I wasn't quite finished. <laughs> Same because of technical problem, I wasn't quite finished from last night and I didn't want to start all over again. So. I just decided I'm just going to continue tonight and talk about what we talked about last night. So, take a close look at this this formula here, this this thing here. Re rewards versus penalty. 
results versus excuses, can versus can't. And you figure out what side of the equation you're on. You're on you're either on one of these one of the sides. You can't be on both sides. You're on the one side. Okay? You have to figure out what side. When you figure that out, you can know what kind of mindset you have and what and what you need to work on to change. Because as I said, the ultimate the ultimate goal for us is that we want to get a different results that we have been getting. Okay? You know, the, we want to get, so that's the ultimate thing. We want a different results. We want to eliminate the excuse, get rid of the excuses, and get start getting different results. If you're sick and tired of being sick and tired, if, you, if you're tired of, you know, working, 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 and, and not, not simply beginning ahead, if you're, um, you seem to have more money at the end of the money, you know, you're working two jobs, you know, you still not seem to be getting ahead, you're just grinding away at life, and you just seem to be spinning the wheel, not getting anywhere, whether it's in the finances, your relationship, your spiritual life, whatever. If you're tired of those kind of things, then you have to look at, look, take a look at your paradigm, your paradigm, your mindset, okay? And that's what these videos is all about. Me doing, that's what me doing this live, because this is what I'm doing for my own self, and so what I'm doing, I'm teaching you what I'm, <laughs> what I'm learning and doing in my own life. Anyways, that's going to be it for tonight. I thank you, everybody, for tuning in. Um, whether you're watching the live, like my friend here, Benjamin, or you're watching the replay, I really, greatly, greatly appreciate you tuning in and watching. I hope you guys will come back again tomorrow. We're going to continue talking about this, but but again from a different perspective but it's going to be i'm going to, I'm going to continue asian of what we're talking about tonight it's going to still be about your mindset and about paradigms but from a different perspective tonight was just only a continuation from last night because of what happened last night so god bless you i love you peace